He was nothing. Hi guys, Assalamualaikum for today's video. I'll be using a black lipstick. So if you want to know what it's up to with my black lipstick, and then this is the final look. Keep on watching, okay? Okay, first I use my bullet lipstick, which I got from uh, Beauty Cosmetic. Uh, to cover all my blemishes on my face and especially my eye bags so if you want to know the product please go to my description box I already link everything down below and then I apply concealer O2O concealer this is a um, not fully coverage concealer it's for daily concealer and then I dab my face using wet sponge I always 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 use wet sponge because I want my makeup to last long remember to dab on the place where you put your concealer only After that, I use the same sponge and then I apply my foundation. Usually, I will apply my foundation with brush first. But today, I want to try something new. I directly use my wet sponge. And it turned out to be good actually because, I don't know, I don't like to use wet sponge directly because it will absorb a lot of my products. But, I don't know, I just you know try and error this time and this time i'm using foundation that is that match 100% to my skin tone if you want to know whether it's right or not you can check my hand and check my face they are the same right i use this high coverage concealer from zafi cosmetic to be honest this is my favorite concealer right now it has the same performance as the high end product as Tarte if I'm not mistaken and then I use this uh, blusher tanam technique uh, the one that we always use for bright so that my blush will last long and after that I set my face using a two-way cake two-way kick <laughs> Okay, this is my base eyeshadow remember to always put your base eyeshadow first when you are doing eyeshadow application and then I start to take a little bit dark brown and I apply it only on my crease and now I'm using a dark a really dark brown and I apply slowly on my crease so that my crease will pop out remember to use the pointy brush And now I'm taking a black color and I apply using a flat brush only on my crease. So remember for this look, focus on your crease. And now I'm taking the same high coverage concealer which is from Zafi Cosmetic and I apply a little bit on my eyelid and then I take a pointy brush and then I blend them carefully not to touch your crease now I'm 
applying my yellow eyeshadow so carefully apply your yellow eyeshadow the reason you put your concealer because you want to pop the yellow color because not many palette can produce yellow color that is very pigmented so to overcome this you apply concealer first and then I apply a goldish yellow or maybe goldish orangey on the same place where I apply the yellow color to make it look a bit shimmer or sparkle and now I use a pen eyeliner from Kimius Cosmetic this is the dupe to Kat Von D Cosmetic trust me if you buy this uh, maybe around like 6 ringgit plus uh, in Malaysia uh, and then you can compare it with Kat Von D it has the same performance same um, design same tip and same everything this is like the cheap version of Kat Von D favorite part I like to do contouring which I'm contouring my nose now this is this is how I contour my nose if you want to know how I get my sharp nose it's fake it's fake it's from makeup Now I'm applying my blusher. If you have a bright eyeshadow, use a natural color blusher, which is like uh, a sandy color. Now we are at our critical part, which is the black lipstick. So this lipstick I got from Shopee. It is around like six ringgit or four ringgit. I, I cannot remember. Uh, I bought it for I don't know. I bought it because it's for it's for nothing. It's just want to try a black lipstick besides it's cheap and if you want to know it is smudge proof and easy to apply but they have this kind of scent like um i don't know maybe like flowery scent or chewing gum scent or vanilla scent i don't know i don't know the exact scent and this is my first time using a black lipstick because it's not normal in malaysia to use a black lipstick but for the sake of this video i want to use this black lipstick so i do look a bit weird and i do look like uh, how do we call that a ghost or something but i am very satisfied with this look because it really complement the eyeliner the eyes and the whole makeup so if you guys you know have something about this look if you guys want to know all the product that I use I link everything in my description box below and then if you like this look please give a thumbs up and then subscribe to my channel uh, I will try the best I can to upload more video in one month <laughs> okay thank you